Hi everyone, this is the Gas Walkthrough for April 22nd. I'm Philip Newman, and I am filling in for Bill today. So this is a puzzle by Clover. I don't normally get to solve Clover puzzles on the channel, so... Um, this is all odd or even. So we have normal Sudoku rules. Additionally, within each 3x3 region, all of the green cells are either all odd or all even. So either these are all even or they're all odd. Normal Sudoku rules from the 9H row column and by the box. And those are the rules. And we will start in box one, as is often a good place to start in a clover puzzle. Um, can these all be odd? Well, no, because there are already two odd digits in the box, and there are only five odd digits from one to nine. This would be six odd digits. So these are all even. There's a 2, 4 up here, so these are 6 and 8, and we know the order. And then these are 2 and 4, and we know the order from that 2. Now, these have to both be odd, and this has to be odd, because we have all the even digits in the row, and because we can't fit four more even digits in the box. So these are all odd. Um, I will go ahead and mark 5, 7, 9 here. And this is actually a 5. We have a 7 here, 1, 3, and 9. So this is 5. Now we have a 7, 9 pair, so these are from 1 to 5. This is 1 or 3, so 7 here. And just classic, where does 7 go in this box? It can only go here. These are from 1, 3, 4, and 8. We have a 4 and 8 in a row. So this is where 4 and 8 go. There's a 4 here. And this is a 6 in the row to finish it off. We still need 1, 3, 5, and 8. This is not 5, this is not 3. Over here we need 5, 7, and 9. There's a 9 here, a 9 goes there, there's a 7 here. And so none of these are 5. So that 5 we just placed, this is 5. And that is most of the top finish. See anything else we can do immediately. Alright, down here, these are all going to have to be odd because we have two even digits in the box. We have a 3 and a 5 here, and a 7 here, so this is 1 or 9. Uh, this is 1, 7 or 9. Uh, this can be anything except 7, I'm not going to mark that yet. Alright, here, these all have to be even, so I can box 1. Because we already have two odd digits in the box. These can't be 4 and 6 in the row. So these are 2 and 8. There's a 2 here. And then these are 4 and 6, and there's a 4 here. And now, again, we have all of the even digits in the row. So all of these green cells are odd. This is 1 or 3. And now we have a 1, 3 pair. And in fact, we have all of the odd digits. So these are going to have to be the remaining even digits. And this one can't be 8 or 6, so it's 2. This is also odd, so it is 1, 7, or 9, but we have a 7, 9 here. It's not a 1, uh, 9, and not a 7. These are again 1, 3, 5. This is 8 in a row. These are 1, 2, 3, 5. This is not 5 or 1. This is not 3. Over here, we still need an 8. Uh, we still need a 9 here, we need a 7 here, and then this is 1, and that places 1 in this box. This is 3, a 1, and 3. This is not 1, uh, this is not 8, so this is 1, 8 in that order. The 9 here gives us 7 and 9. These are 1, 7, and 8. We have 7s here, so this is our 7. Here we have 4, 5, and 6. And these green cells have to be either all odd or all even. Well, there's only one odd digit here, so it's going to have to be all even. So this is 5. Now the 1, 8 here is resolved because this has to be even. These are 2 and 3. The 8 here gives us 6 and 8. Across here we need 1, 2, 3, 4, but we have 1, 2, 4 in the column, so that's a 3. And now these have to be odd. They are 1 and 5. So we have the other odd digits. Makes that a 2, that a 3, that a 5. This is 6. 
need a nine and a five for the ball. These are two and four in some order. Uh, and this is a four in the columns. So two, four. This is six and four. The one in the row. This is five and one. These are one, three, five. One has to go there. And the five gives us three and five, three and two. Here we have six and nine. And two and eight. And that is how you solve all odd or even uh, by Clover. Uh, let us know how you found that. And leave us a comment. I'll see you next time.